Yo guys, welcome back to another video. And for today's video, I'm going to be doing a story time of how I met my favorite NRL player. If I look kind of rough at the moment, that's because I literally just woke up and I wanted to film um, this video in the morning. I know this is not the normal spot where I film videos, but I couldn't do it in my room, so I'm literally doing it in like this, well, like this closet or whatever. Yeah, so without further ado, let's get into the video. So yeah, pretty much I'm just going to go through like um, the whole day and then I'll just be talking about what happened and it was actually kind of awkward what happened because since i met literally my favorite nrl player and i know i don't talk about the nrl at all on this channel but yeah i do follow it and i do have my favorite player so pretty much it was just a normal day i'm on school holidays at the moment and my grandma's over here in townsville so pretty much i we went to is it um, woolworth or coles i think it might have been coles so we went there and I was just walking around the store and I thought nothing of it. Of it, this week felt very weird. Just a bunch of random shit kept happening throughout the week. So I was like, if something's gonna happen this week, um, I was like, if something's gonna happen, it's probably gonna happen today, like another weird shit. Um, See, so yeah, I was just walking around um, with the trolley and then I literally look over and then I saw, um, his name's called Jason Tomalala, I'm pretty sure most of you guys know who he is. Um, I'll put a photo up on the screen of who the person is afterwards, um, a photo of him. And then, yeah, pretty much, I just saw him and I'm like, holy shit, he's actually here. And then I was like, to my mum, mum, that's uh, the player I kept, I always talk about when um, I'm watching, like, the NRL and stuff. So, yeah, and she was like, is that actually him? And I was like, yeah. And then she was like, well, do you want to ask? Do you want to ask him to take a photo? And I'm like, me, I get really anxious, like, talking to, like, brand new people. And people in general, if you know me, you know me. And then pretty much I just, I was like, nah, 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 nah. And then she was like, well, do you want me to call him over? And I'm like, I don't know, I don't know. And then, yeah, and then my grandma was like, I'll go over him and say you want a photo. And then he came over. And then I'm like, okay, we're going to get a photo. He was like, yeah, sure. Um, yeah, it's no problem. And then I'm pretty, I'm, I'm pretty sure he was, I'm pretty sure he was only coming over. I'm pretty sure he was only at Woolies for like, just to get like one thing. So I felt kind of bad asking for a photo. So yeah, he was like, oh yeah, sure. And this is where the embarrassing thing happened. So yeah, my mum was taking a photo with my phone. Because if, if we did it with her phone, the quality was not going to be as good. So I was like, yeah, just do it with my phone. And it took at least like... 10 times to get an actual photo because my mom f forgot how to take a photo she said she was pressing it but she wasn't and i'm like oh no man and so the first photo and it was like okay let me see it and it's like nope not there and then the second time nope not there third time nope not there and then he was like oh i have to give something to my wife can i just quickly go and then come back and then we're like okay and then i'm like oh my god why isn't the photo taken and then the fourth time it didn't happen, and then the fifth time she actually took it. And I'm like, God, oh my God, man. I'm literally talking to him, and I'm like, sorry, man, sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry to keep you waiting and all that. Because literally she took a photo, and then it went, it literally showed the, like, the floor. And I'm like, man, what is going on? It was literally so awkward, and I just felt bad the whole time. But anyways, I love that I was able to get a photo with him, but it was also the most awkward moment ever. Because how does not someone not mess take a photo? Anyway, this is not to roast anyone. You know, shit happens sometimes. But Jason Tom Lala is one of the nicest people I've ever met. He was like, nah, you're good, you're good. No. By the way, if you guys are wondering where the Cardiff City um, manager career mode is, um, I'm still yet to get the um, FIFA 22. So once I get FIFA 22, the series will return. Um, I don't know if I'll start them in the Premier League like I was when I finished it last year. Um, I'll probably just start in the championship because since, since I'll start the um, career mode earlier, um, I'll the, the career mode can literally go on for so long. We could be in the Premier League for like three years because last year when I last year last time when I started it, I started it like I don't know when was it? Was it like April around then when I started the career mode? Um, so yeah, I'll be starting it now and then yeah, we'll be there'll be so many videos on it. So yeah. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this story. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. That'll be very appreciated. And yeah, I'll be back with another video soon. Peace.
Peace out. Diving off the stage in the crowd, it's a mosh pit. Yeah, shout it bad, but she broke and she don't own shit. Mama asked me, son, when the trapping gon' quit. I been riding around through the city in my new bitch. Young nigga, 